Hey folks, it is Sunday before we begin week eight. And I told some of you that you should go down to the river and take a walk this weekend. And um, that's exactly what I'm doing finally. Um, I walked uh, that way when the sun was setting and I stopped somewhere and had a little bite to eat. And now I'm walking home. I just walked under the, the, the Purple People Bridge between uh, here in Kentucky, Newport. And I am right now uh, in front of um, our namesake. This is Lucius Q. Cincinnatus. And if you're from here, you probably doubtlessly know this already, but <clears throat> um, this is, uh, uh, Lucius was, what was it, was a Greek. And um, during, I don't know, some, through some more time, he, uh, he he volunteered to lead his people, and um, when when they were victorious and the war was over, they they offered him uh, leadership, dictatorship, and uh, he turned it down and went back to his his farm, and um, he's in this statue depiction. He's turning back over uh, the symbols of. More, more time in leadership, and on the other hand, he's holding his plow. If you can see that, so um, Lucius Q. Cincinnatus. This was, um, this was he was there, George Washington, before long before our George Washington. Um, our, we just celebrated uh, President's Day and Washington's birthday. I don't know a week or so ago, and um, uh, there was a well, there was. A, was a, there was a society called the Cincinnati Society at the time, and uh, and uh, it was sort of uh, modeled after kind of George Washington's mentality. So um, Cincinnati was named Wilsonville at the time. It's the supposedly the first American city, major city after uh, the Revolutionary War. So considered the first, you know, um, most American city. And um, and shortly after, it was um, named Cincinnati after Lucius Q here. And uh, I'll show you one more thing since I'm over here. So again, I'm at the foot of the of the Purple People Bridge. And um, if you've never been down here, it's been a while since you've been down here. Um, come on down here. Maybe uh, maybe during the daytime. I don't know how much I recommend you guys all walk around here at night like I foolishly might be doing, but. Uh, I do it so often I keep my eyes in it, but I, I'm not worried. So the other thing I'm going to show you here is um, uh, Pegasus. What's his name? Gosh, he's got a name. Um, so I can't remember one of our flying pigs here. Um, so um, modeled after Lucius Q. So <laughs> one of our <laughs> one of our pigs. So anyway, there's the Purple People Bridge and Newport off in the distance. All right, so I hope you enjoyed your weekend, and um, tomorrow morning when I come into classes, it's going to be a complete change of weather. We had such a beautiful weekend here yesterday and today, and tomorrow is going to be um, extremely windy and rainy all day, so I'm not quite looking forward to that. So I'm enjoying the nice warm walk today and the week weekend weather. So I hope you did the same, and I hope you're geared up for week number eight. All right, so. Keep up the good work, everybody. Proud of you. And I'll see you here next time. Bye for now.